people know uh, what's going on, where are you traveling, uh, what's going on? I see the Team USA shirt. On Friday, Friday morning, I leave to Colorado Springs for the um, women's round robin at the Olympic Training Center. How does that feel? Like you've been putting in a lot of work, but now you get to kind of compete. Um, I'm ready to have all the hard work pay off and I'm ready to compete and have fun and represent my country. How much have you sacrificed for this opportunity? Weekends, months, few months already. Um, all my time after school, but I feel like it's worth it, and I really want it. So. Yeah. And like, where might you travel to compete if you win? Um, as of right now, I don't know, but um, for the next Worlds, I'll pro I might go across seas. I don't. Um, I know. A few years ago, a few years ago, the girls went to Taiwan or Taipei. Okay. So, yeah. What does it feel like to be a woman in boxing? It's kind of like a male-dominated sport. Um, I mean, I don't feel a lot different because I put in just as much work and just as much time, and I sacrifice just as much. So I mean, yeah. And how would you define the city of Hayward that you're from? Like, what would you say? Um, how would you describe it to someone that's never been there? Uh, I would say it's, it's not that big. I mean, yeah, it's not that big. It's, it's an okay city. It's not the best city, but yeah. And one fighter right now that you're influenced and inspired by? Um, definitely Andre Ward because I love his style, the way he carries himself, and yeah, everything. And coming from Hayward, do you ever think like you walk by a place and go, maybe he ate at this burger place? Or? Yeah, um, I actually go to the same high school he graduated from, Hayward High. So yeah, I feel like it, it's, it's motivational to know that he came from where I came from and that it's possible to make it out. Okay, and finally, how'd you get your nickname? Um, my dad gave it to me when I was about six or seven. I was sparring actually, and then he was like, um, you gotta hit him with the dynamite, you know, and then it just stuck with me. And then, isn't there another dynamite too? Uh, David, yeah. So, do you guys ever compete about that nickname or what? Did you guys start start in the same day? I always heard there was a story. Yeah, we started um, around the same age and we started training together and yeah, we just were both the di we're two dynamites. So you're the you're the female dynamite and he's the male dynamite and you're fine with that? Yeah.